Yo guys, welcome back to a new PDCGO Chilling Rain video. Today, guys, we're taking a look at the brand new Single Strike Volcanian V. This card is pretty cool. Um, basically, you just don't want to attack it because this attack Dynamite Tackle for 3 energy can do 100 damage. And if this Pokemon has 10 or more damage counters on it, this can do 150 more damage. Meaning that if you hit Volcanian for more than 100 damage, you're doing... 250 damage with Volcanion, and of course, this will work with Single Strike Energy, meaning that against a Tag Team Pokemon, we can do 270 damage, which will knock out Tag Team Pokemon pretty easily, but it just also hits very hard. It can put a lot of damage. Now, we are going to play Cape of Toughness so that we can give it 270 HP, but we're also going to be playing the brand new Obama Snow here, which allows your Single Strike Pokemon, except Obama Snow, to have 50 more HP. So with an Obama Snow in play and a Cape on, Volcanion is going to go all the way to 320 HP, pretty much guaranteeing that it can take a hit or two, which is really cool. So this is what I am playing here for my list. It is a Welder build. We can actually play Single Strike Terrain Tar V, since it kind of works with Welder too. It has some Colossus Inish attack cost. So Craigalanch can be powered up fairly easily with Welder. And of course, if we're... Shadow Rider, Tyrant Tar can be really good alongside Cape and Obama Snow also. So before we get the video, of course, shout out to the sponsor, Car Cabin TCG. As always, guys, if you're ever looking to get any PTCG pack codes, get them over at Car Cabin. Car Cabin sells codes online for the cheapest. So if you guys want to pick up any set codes, like Chilling Rain, Battle Style, Sword Shield, Base Set, or if you're looking for any pre-release kit codes or GX or V promo codes, get them over at Car Cabin. If you get any codes over at Car Cabin, of course, guys, at the checkout, use my discount code, code LDF for a 5% discount on your purchase. Help channel, help yourself out. And about Car Cabin too. So shout out Car Cabin, check them out. Use Crawl DF, get any codes. Also, if you want to check out the video articles I've been posting, it'd be greatly appreciated too. Give them a watch. Anyways, let's look at the list of what I'm playing. So this is what I'm rocking with here. Again, Obama Snow Volcanian is kind of the combo we're playing. Um, but we get that ability to play that terrain turn. Now I am playing a 1-1 Houndoom line for that single strike roar to potentially add the extra damage on if your opponent doesn't put you um in that range of 100 hp sometimes the opponent can play around the damage output and two shot you by not doing 100 damage and then going with a big attack that will one shot you because they softened you up with an attack below 100 damage but the houndoom is good for single strike roar to get energy in play to be honest though i'm not sure the houndoom is really that needed in this video so it's a probably a cuttable cuttable card you can probably cut the houndoom if you want um so this is Wilder deck with the play Denani Crobat Eldegoss. I uh, wouldn't mind playing a second Denani, but I also have some Poke Gears in the deck to help you find the Welders alongside four Giant Hearth to make sure not only are we stopping Path the Peak, but we're also finding our Fire Energy for our Welder. Um, got four capes. We're just going all in. Again, four cape is very important because you want to find one on your Volcanion as soon as possible. Um, Fire Crystal, three Switch in the deck. Uh, I am playing one Balloon, but Switch is also good to switch out Obama Snow because it does have a three Retreat cost. I am playing one Urn to get back your Single Strike Energies. Not sure it's needed. It is cuttable if you really wanted to. Four Single Strike Energy, nine Fire Energy to round out the Energy Count. Um, that's the list. Uh, let's go see if it works and see how uh, Single Strike Volcanium plays. And again, the goal is we take some big knockouts. We'll see how it does. We got, what, 320 HP in total. So uh, let's see if this Volcanium can put in work today. All right, here we go into the first match with Volcanian Single Strike here. We have won the coin flip. We are playing a Welder deck, um, so we probably want to go second, even though we do play multiple different Stage 1 Pokemon. Um, so going first can also be okay, too, uh, but I do think we want to go second. We do have a Welder here, so if we can get into an Energy or a Giant Hearth, we can attack with Volcanian. Looks like we are playing against Dark Box in our first game here. Dark Box definitely could be... An interesting matchup. I'm not sure. Honest, I'm honestly sure how it'll play. Um, not looking great, though, with our start. Uh, we'll see, though. We can maybe KO their Sneasel, actually, if we can get the Volcanion off. Even just one Fire Energy can let us do the attack. I think the first attack is like 2 for 50. We can make that 2 for 70. Uh, but, oh, they're actually going to let us hit the Mewtwo first. Okay, I actually kind of like this. This is good. All right, what do we draw? Nothing useful. That's a shame. That is a shame. If only we had a Fire Energy, we could have attacked here. I mean, I don't even really want to research, though. I don't really want to lose two Welders, but... I'm not going to have much of a choice. Yeah, we're going to have to research here. We're going to lose a few of our Welders, which kind of sucks. Um, Alright, not terrible. I mean, we got Welder for next turn. Still no giant hearth though, which is unfortunate. Um, probably just gonna pass. I do want to get Snover to be honest. I wouldn't mind getting Snover here. Um, we have Welder. 
Might need Crowbat. I'm going to pass. I need to, because what can happen is my opponent will probably do 100 damage to me. And then we die and might tackle them for a knockout. We will be hitting for 270 damage. So, I mean, I kind of want to just save the thing there. Ooh, they could have Martied me. That could have been scary. Okay, they'll set up Weavile. They might have a Dedenny or Crowbat in their hand. I'm imagining they do. Or else they wouldn't have sacked the Marnie like that. Unless they already have like a research for next turn. I mean, they'll hit me with Black Lance here for 150. Then we'll knock him out as long as we can find a fire energy. This Mewtwo will get cooked up by the Volcanian. Um, but will that happen? All right. So they hit me for 150. That does activate Dynamite Tackle's full effect. Now we just need a fire energy and there we go. Okay. So I'm going to calm here for um, Snover. And we are going to Welder to the active. We should be okay off of this, right? Yeah, another Volk is pretty good. Fire energy and Dynamite Tackle will KO my opponent for 270 damage with the single strike energy. And there's that knockout. And all we have to do now is KO the Umbreon Darkrai to win the game. Now, uh, they could knock me out. If they can go... Actually, no, they can't attack me. I just realized. Yeah, they can't attack my Volcanion. And when we get our Obama Snow in play, we're going to get Volcanion... Um, even more HP so that we can't even get knocked out by the Umbreon Darkrai, which is pretty good. Okay, they are going to Marnie me, though. Okay. All right, never mind. Obama Snow's gone. We got boss, though, so... <laughs> we will just win here by bossing up the Darkrai. Looks like they're playing Cheryl. So, Malamar, it looks like. Malamar could be a little annoying for our deck because we don't really play that many draw cards, so, like, they could easily lock me. Um... We'll see what happens, though. It's looking pretty good right now. My point... I, the most they can do is Dark Moon me. But if they Dark Moon me, we win the game. So they have to reset stamp me here to stop me from winning. Um, which, they're digging for something. They just need a reset stamp or a crushing hammer combo, which I doubt they play. So they have to stamp me here to prevent me from winning the game. If they don't stamp me, we are going to take the dub here. We are just going to boss up... Zombie on Darkrai, a dynamite tackle will knock it out, and that will be all she wrote. Yeah, there's a quick ball. Yeah, they do play Malamar. And again, Malamar can lock a deck like this. You know, Welder decks don't really have... They have a lot... They have draw cards, but very few in between. Ooh, looks like they're just going to go Mew this turn to, like, sack it, which is fine. My opponent doesn't know they Marty me into the boss, but there is the reset stamp. Okay, we could still get the boss off of, like, the Denny or Crobat or Pokegear. <laughs> Stamp is a lie, bro. It's a lie. Not only do they just stamp me into the boss, they stamp me into both bosses. The game's like, yo, I heard you need a boss to win the game. Here you go. Have two bosses. That's pretty unfortunate for my opponent. I mean, what can you do? But I mean, Volcanion, after my opponent Black Lance me, we literally were just able to one-shot two tag teams and win the game in just two attacks, which is pretty good. Pretty good if you ask me. Pretty good. That's the power of Volcanion. If if you if you damage it, it hits back very hard. Okay, here we go. We've lost the coin flip. Ooh, could be against Charizard. That's not really a good matchup for this deck. Well, maybe it is actually. We have 320 HP. They can't one shot me. Uh, yo, camera gonna focus. There we go. Yeah, we're playing against a Charizard deck, aren't we? Start with Eldegoss. That's not really that good, no sir. We're playing against a fire deck. Eldegoss was the worst starter. Yeah, we're playing against Charizard, aren't we? No, Blacephalon. That's pretty bad, too. Grab Volk, I guess. When am I getting a Bomb of Snow? But I'd rather grab Volk. We can float up next turn if we don't get KO'd, so there's that. How do we beat Blacephalon, though? Fireball Circus is bad. We have a Bomb of Snow and Cape, though, to make him have to do 350 damage, so maybe that can be our win condition. We can one-shot the Blacephalons with Volk. Yeah, maybe we can beat Volcanion. This might not actually that be that bad. Maybe. Maybe. So watch out for Cram, though, because the Bomb of Snow is going to be a very important card in this matchup. Actually, we're going to lose a Bomb of Snow, potentially. No, looks like Eldegoss is a goner. Yep. Eldegoss is a goner, of course. Hmm. We'll see. Yep, Eldegoss is a goner. Sorry, buddy. You just had to not be in our starting hand to not get KO'd. We can try to KO the Blacephalon, though, with a Welder here. Cherish Ball. Ooh, they're going to Dene. Yeah, I want to try to keep the hand. I want to try to Welder into a Knockout with Volcanion. Get a Cape and a Snowver now. That would be pretty good. Or a Choreo. Sure. 
I have not played Gethel Sapphire in a long time. Maybe they don't have a knockout. Maybe they're like just short. No. Sorry, or Eldegoss, but I mean, you had one job and it was just not be in the active spot. Sorry, buddy. You just got cheesed out by the Welder Donk. It happens. All right, let's try to get energy in a snowbird down. Um, there's the energy. Hmm. We'll do Welder first. I'm not trying to give my opponent a giant hearth. Well, I mean, the game might just be over here because we got no basic. We got no cape of toughness either, so we'll see if they can get me here. There's a quick ball. Okay, we can get another... We can get the snowbird down. Uh, maybe I should have played the giant hearth. Then I don't want to give my opponent a giant hearth. That's why I didn't play it. I'm like, oh, make them find their giant hearth. I'm not trying to give them two free energy, especially because we did whiff the snowbird. And if we did whiff again, even with the giant hearth, it's like, well, the likelihood of Volk going down is super high. We'll see if they can get a KO here. Yep. There's Placephalon. Yep, there's the knockout. They have Welder in their hand, so... We're uh, probably going to lose. Reshizard. That won't one-shot me. And if they actually go with Reshizard... Well, they could have Goon, I guess. They could Goon ping me twice, but, like... That's unlikely. They would need a lot to work up. If they actually double-blaze me here... We will knock him out with Dynamite Tackle. That was the nice thing about the Dynamite Tackle single strike combo you saw in that first game there. The 270 damage was perfect numbers. That's why I was thinking this matchup is fine, like... Tanking Bocephalon with a Bomb of Snow Cape is really good, but also Reshizar doesn't work as well because of our 270 damage attack we can do. Yeah, if they double blaze me here, oh. They actually have the goon combo off of that welder. There's no way. There's actually no way. Okay, I was gonna say, bro. That's just no way. Okay, that's good. We survived the turn. Which is pretty good. Alright, we're gonna have to quick ball. I'm just gonna get a snowbird. Get that thing down now. We will get a knockout here, which is really, really good. We need to find a cape this turn, though. There we go. Hmm. We're getting three prizes, so I'm got to imagine we're going to get something good off our prizes here. So I'm going to have to rely on that. Grab ourselves another Volk. We have to cape the active. It's kind of weird, I know, but we have to because we could get knocked out by uh, the goon. So we have to make sure that's protected. We can giant hearth away the boss. I kind of want to keep it because we can use it to kill or a Corio at some point. Um, but I do want to thin out the deck. I think I'm going to have to just to make sure we draw out of this. We are going to take some prizes, but I'm going to make sure our deck is nice and thinned out. I know we have the Fire Crystal in our hand when we go down, but I want to make sure our deck is thinned out so we can keep attacking with Volcanion here. There's a Quick Ball. That's good. Hey, Welder. I don't even know if Welder's prize. Yeah, never mind. Okay, that's fine. So we're protected from the Goon Ping. I actually thought they had me there, bro. I actually thought they had me. That was close. <laughs> that was very close. They shouldn't even have went with Reshi's art because they could have at least flare striked me and hoped I didn't have a welder. Okay, they're going with another Reshi's art. I, I don't know if I agree with that because it can't one-shot Volcanion and it gets one-shot super easily by Dynamite Tackle. They should be just going Bolcephalon here, I feel like. You know, there's the scuba net. So yeah, they were very close to finding it. Yeah, they, I feel like they should be going Bolcephalon, right? Because the Reshi's art... And one shot Volk with the with the HP modifiers, and it gets one shot in return if they don't one shot me. Um, I guess they can like outrage me a little bit. We can also just not attack the Reshizard, so we don't walk into an outrage into a flare strike. That's like one way they can do something. They can like outrage me so that I don't go below, so I don't go have 10 H 10 damage on me, so I can't activate Dynamite my tackle, and then they can finish me off with like a flare strike. That's one thing they can do. So I can just not attack the Reshizard at all. I could just, like, not attack him. You see why I wanted to keep the boss, though? Because if they don't kill me this turn, we can just boss her or a Corio and take the win. But I think I had to do it for the greater good. Yeah, well, let's see what they do. We have 6 HP here, so they need quite a bit. Yeah, they have Cram. We do need to get the, uh... We actually do need to find a, uh... Mew this turn, too. Oh, if only I kept the boss, bro! I would have had game! No! Alright, let's get the Obama Snow down. Get another energy here. Uh, quick ball. Or... We can grab Mew right now. We could Dedenne for the last boss. That's probably just better. We're going to lose some energy, but that's fine. We should have enough energy to win the game. Don't need the other Volcanian anyways, because my phone's got too bad. There we go. We got boss. All right. Look at that. Just boss up this guy again and just dynamite tackle for the win. All right. We didn't really get to use the Obama's no cape combo in this matchup that much, but... The game just gave me the boss. Yeah, I should have held the boss earlier, to be honest. But, again, it is what it is. I was expecting to get knocked out anyways. Like, you got to imagine you're going to get killed. But there you go. Dynamite Tackle 
the tag team slayer. That was close though. We almost could have lost the game to that goon ping. Okay, uh, heads. Nope. Will we get to go second? No. Ooh, we're up against that welder deck again. People love their welder decks. Ooh, if only we did go second, we would have had a pretty good start here. We'll see if we can draw into a snowver. That'd be pretty cool. We can get the Obama snow down right away, which is nice. Um, no. Volcanian versus Volcanian, though. Yes, the battle y'all have been waiting for. I really want to calm for Obama snow, but I might need it for like Dedene, so I'm just going to pass. I really want to, yeah, I really want to get Snover down there or like, yeah. I don't think we're going to get knocked. But I did want to get Snover down there so that at least we can get the Obama snow into play. We're playing against another Reshizar deck, which we are. I mean, once again, the same thing can apply. It's just they don't one shot me and then I just one shot them with Dynamite Tackle. Okay, they have Victini V Max though. That's a little bit tougher to deal with because it's got more HP. They're probably not going to use Reshizar then. We can kill their Volk early on though. I do still want to get a Bomba Snow in play. We actually need to put a cape on though, too, so we don't get killed by victory, whatever. Okay. Because we might have just did any the hand away, right? This might just have to be a did any hand. It probably will have to be, because we're not going to draw anything, are we? Expected. Here we go. Welder for one. No. Not terrible. But, yeah, it's just not, not the ideal hand we're looking for. So we have to did any the hand away. We're going to lose some important resources, is what it is. Well, this hand's not that good either. We got the cape, though, so at least we can protect ourselves. But uh, we didn't get a Snover or a way to find Snover, which is also unfortunate. So we can Dynamite Tackle KO them, take a prize. Maybe it's a Snover, you know. There you go. We got a Snover. Actually, I kind of want to get another Volk, though. We have more Volks than Snover, so... No, we actually, we have the same amount. Hmm, I don't know, then. At least we're going to survive a hit here. We can smack them right back with Dynamite Tackle. That's what I was hoping we would be able to do. Maybe we can finish them off with Hound Dower. And before my opponent plays a Tool Jammer or a Tool Scrapper, they have a Mawile in their deck. Interesting. The Mawile tech. Let's see if they can KO my Volk this turn. Do they have a Tool Scrapper or a Tool Jammer? One time. I know they play it, bro. And I know they're going to find it, bro. I know they're going to have it when they need it. Nope. All right. So we can't KO the Victini this turn, but we can hit them hard. It's just an over. All right. This kind of works, though. We can actually get our boy. We can get the Volk now. All right. This is fine. There's research. Could have played the giant hearth, but not going to. Another cape is good. We can attach. We didn't get a welder for next turn. It's the only problem with that. I'm just going to hold the hand and hit them with dynamite tackle. Yeah, don't attack Volcanian, folks, if you can't one-shot it, because as you can see, this Victini is going to get slain. We actually don't even need the dynamite tackle next turn again. We can just knock it out with heat blast. Looks like they might be eyeing up a heat ran, though. Then we have to find boss's order. We still have both bosses in the deck, so we can try to crowbat into boss here. Boss out the Heat Ran, or boss out the Victini and knock it out. Then we just gotta kill Heat Ran to win the game. I gotta imagine they're gonna go Heat Ran this turn because they they might have to, you know? They're probably gonna have to go with the Heat Ran. Victini's looking a little sickly here. They can go Heat Ran, retreat and hot burn me here, um, which will KO me. Even if we have this Obama Snow in play, they still could have hot burn KO'd me. So that's nothing that we can do to stop hot burn. Again, if we can find the we can find our boss here, we can kill the Victini. If only we did 10 more damage, we actually could have Mew KO'd it, which would have been even better. But I like having the Mew in play because they probably play Cram V Max. So I want to protect it. There's a switch. Yeah, they're gonna go into the Heat Ran. They waste a hot burn on me though. Oh, and they can steaming stomp me, actually. Okay. With the Obama Snow giant cape on Cape of Toughness, we will try to survive a hot burn GX. Yeah, I'm not I'm scared of hot burn, not gonna lie. Hot burn scares me. Hmm. I think we gotta take out the Heat Rain. This might be a bigger threat, to be honest. Yeah, that's a bigger threat than the Victini at this point. I have Volk. You lived a good life. I think we wanna just kill the Heat Rain, though. Okay, what do we draw? Witch. Evolve into Bomb of Snow. How many Android Fires do we have left? We don't have Fire Crystal. So, you know, we still have a few. We can discard Switch for another Volk. We could get another Snover down, too. I want to keep the Benson open for Crobat, though. Might just attack them here. So, they have, what, 3 energy on? That's 150. They can go 150 Hot Burn, 200, 250, 300. So, they can't knock me out next turn with Hot Burn unless they play Cape of Toughness. Or, not Cape. They can't knock me out unless they have Goon Pings or a Tool Scrapper slash Tool Jammer. That's the only way they can kill my Volk here with a Hot Burn GX. 
go if we can't get one shot, we might as well try to boss her Victini then and then kind of checkmate them. Sure. Back this, I guess. Fail it. Yes, cape the mute. Oh, that's busted. Now we can't get one shot by max victory. Big brain. Alright, boss one time. No. Oh! Spoke too soon. High heat blast. If we find our last boss, we can win the game. Or if they just attack with heat rain, we win. There's a welder. Okay, here. Now, the only problem with our spot we're in right now is we don't have another immediate bulk. So we're going to have to power up the Mew here um, so we can retreat it. And then we'll have to go into... Yeah, we'll attach the Mew, go into the Volk next turn, go from there. So yeah, Heat Rain cannot one shot me. The most they can put in is three energy in play, which is only going to do 300 damage. Unless they have a Tool Scrapper, Goon Ping, or a... I mean, they can kill my Obama Snow, and then we just bench another Snover, so that's not going to matter too much. But they're not even damaged me, so that won't even matter. They can knock out Obama Snow, I guess, with, like, Steaming Stomp with a boss, and then, like... And then we can get KO'd by the Hot Burn GX. That, I guess, would work. There's a few ways my opponent can stop me, of course, but we'll see what they got. We'll see what they got here. We're not out of the woodwork yet. Again, we don't have an attacker on our bench we can successfully power up. Not gonna lie, the Hound Doom's been doing nothing. The Hound, we have not used the Hound Doom once in this video. So I'm not even sure we don't, we probably don't need the Hound Hour. We could honestly probably just cut the Hound Doom for like a third of Bomb of Snow. Maybe like a second to Dene or so. There's more draw. Another Poke Gear wouldn't be bad either. Okay, let's see if they're going for the Hot Burn. Maybe they are gonna go for it. Okay, another Power Up Victini. Okay. We are one boss away from winning. So if they just attack me here with the Heat Ram, we are gonna win the game. Ooh, they could, oh, they could go to Dene. They can paralyze me. But that's too late now because they've already wasted their welder. Um, so that's not going to work anymore. So if they just attack me here with the heat ray and we win the game. If they attack with Victini, we have to find boss's order. If we had double single strike energy on the Volcanian here, we could go dynamite tackle the Victini and then finish off with side power. Marshadow? Ooh. Fine. I'll say stamp me to two. They could stamp me to two, actually. They could go stamp two with that. That's probably why they played it. I think they are going to stand me here. Hmm. We might get stamped. To be fair, though, we can still go Dynamite Tackle and then, like, Tom Dower can even finish off Victini. Okay, we're going to get stamped here. Yep. Should have played around it. Crap. That's <laughs> how much I got to know about that. We're going to be fine. What'd I tell you? What did I tell you? Stamp the two is a lie. That's twice in this video, I think, where Stamp has given me a good hand. I think, right? I think it's twice. See what they do. They have to go Vikini. Yeah. Good thing we... They might have a second Stamp, though. All right. Unless we drop... Oh, boss won't win us the game. Switch is a bit of a rough discard. Stamp is a lie, though. What did I tell you? It was a lie. We can Dynamite Tackle here. They do still have 6 HP, so... Ooh, they're still a little tanky, but we can still win with another Volcanian. We have Eldegoss, but we can't play well. Ah, this could be bad, actually. I mean, we're not out of the woodwork yet. We still have Mew to work with. Now they can with Heat Rain. This is bad. This is bad. We didn't get a welder off that research. We can Eldegoss, but that's not going to do much. Can we win the game? If we had a single strike energy there, we could have won the game potentially with like a Hound Doom or something. Yeah, we're not out yet. We still could lose. We're still in the back foot. There's no way to win this turn. Unless we go Houndoom boss. So, do we just promote Mew? Mew, Psy Power. Finish off with like a Hound Dower boss win. Sure. That's if we can find a single strike energy. That's the problem. I don't know if we're going to find one. It might be worth it. I mean, we still have a few left in the deck. Can't do well there this turn. It's just not worth it. We don't have any Obama Snows left, so we can just ditch all these. Tenth Mayor Wing Con. We need a single strike energy to win the game. Can't think of anything else. You know? 
It has to be Psy Power. Of course, they can kill me with the cape on. So close, though. Oh, no. They have boss for game. Oh, I didn't even realize they were that close to winning. Never mind. I didn't even realize. Yeah, there's nothing I could have done in that this scenario. I guess I could have bossed the Mewtwo. I guess. Okay. Yeah, okay. That was actually a lot worse than I thought. I thought we actually... I don't know. I. You guys want me to keep loss in the video. There you go. All right, here we go into another match. We've lost or we've won the coin flip. All right, we'll still go... I think we'll still go second. We are probably going to turn this VMAX here, though, which could be scary. We do open with Volk. Uh, no giant heart, though. Hmm. Yeah, not getting Wilder Giant Hearth here could be bad. No, they're not playing, uh, they're not playing a turn. They have Dedenne. Oh, they're playing a single strike deck. That could be bad. Single strike Urshfu can one-shot me. Single strike Tornadus, not so much. It can still get me, though. Yeah, it could still two-shot me. It'll get scary. I don't know if I want to go Quick Ball for Snover. I do want to get an Obama Snow and play at some point. Okay, nice. Oh, what we could do, we can actually do this. We can sack the Hound. I'm not even sure we're going to need it. There's a cape. Could rip a Welder here. We do. Okay. All right. We got the attack. That's pretty good. Look at that Tower of Darkness coming in clutch. Uh, we'll get rid of... Oh, it's the boss. Yeah, we'll keep the Hound Hour in case we get a Pokecom. Um... We'll welder first. I want to try to get a Snover, but I'm going to save the Quick Ball because I might need it. You never know. Let's try energy. Oh, more capes. We'll get rid of one cape. Might have to just get a Volcanian, but I do want to get... Yeah, I want to get Snover. I want to get... I'd rather get Snover instead, just to have it in play. That extra HP boost can be very important against Tornadus. Tornadus not, doesn't hit as hard as the Urshu VMAX. So if we can try to survive the Tornadus by using the Obama Snow, it's going to be very important. Very, very important. Might be sketchy, though. They can two-shot me. They do evolve right away, though, so they could... They have to, like, triple energy to attack me because they weren't able to find a Hound Hour. There's another Tower of Darkness. We can play that, though, and get rid of the Hound Hour and try to get into another Volk so we can play the second Cape of Toughness. Because if we don't get another Volk down, that's going to be two Cape of Toughnesses gone, and we only have one left to work with, which could get sketchy. So that's going to be pretty important, I think. They might be out of stadiums, too. That's our third Tower. There's a Research. They got to lose a lot of stuff, though. Yeah, a few Hound Doom outs. That's good. There's one Hound Hour. Hmm, maybe if we kept the boss there, we could have been able to boss the Hound Hour and KO, which I wouldn't mind. The less Hound Dooms, the better. I do want to try to hit the Tornadoes here if I can, but I doubt they're going to give me it. They're probably going to let me KO their Dedenne. So that means we can KO Tornadoes VMAX and, like, one other thing, which isn't bad. Yeah, they're going to get a bunch of Hound Hours here. This is a little sketch, for sure. We'll see if they attack me this turn. They could go with the Baby Tornadoes, which can hit me... But Tool Scrapper, bro! What? No! That's the most random card, and they actually found it, and they got rid of my cape. But then they're not attacking me this turn. Not only really have two capes left. That's pretty bad. I guess now we don't have to waste our cape. Yay. Oh, they're digging. They're digging for something. What are they digging for? Do they want to try to attack me this turn? Probably. I do like hitting the Tornadoes VMAX, but the problem is the Tool Scrapper. They definitely don't play two, though. Okay, they found the Powerful Energy. They actually could have went with that, but it's fine. Oh, I didn't mean to bench that. Oops. Yeah, I didn't mean to bench that. I meant to... Yeah, whatever. Let's just research. Yeah, I didn't mean to bench that. Oops. Fine, though. We can actually use it to maybe finish them off. Well, this hand is not very good. Thankfully, the tower is still in play. There we go. Nice. We got the Volk. Got the Obama's. No, we're going to get some prizes, so... I'm going to imagine... We're going to get something here. I'm imagining we're going to get... A Pokemon. Yeah, there we go. There's another Obama's. No. We have 320 HP. This guy has 270 HP. 270 can still easily get KO'd. And that Tool Scrapper got rid of my, next, my last cape. So we have one cape left in the deck for this last Volk. I don't know if two Volks will win us the game. We're about to find out, though. Can they one-shot my Volk this turn? We have 320 HP. Let's see if they can get there. There is a thing. There's a Single Strike Roar. That does put damage on them, but we're only doing 250. So that's what? 300 HP. They're doing 280 damage now. They do Marnie me, which is fine. Our hand was... Mediocre at best. See if we can get a welder off this. Nice. No oh, single strike energy is pretty good too. Okay, now they're doing 300 damage. So they're just shy of a knockout here. If they didn't attach the triple energy, they actually could have KO'd me. Uh, if they found another powerful or single strike. Okay, they're going to spread the energy out. Fair play. Alright, yeah, we're taking the hit here thanks to the Obama Snow Cape. I don't know. Hound Hour could be good. Honestly, we could use Bite to knock something out. That actually could be something we can do. 
I'm, I, I don't regret. No regrets at all, bro. No regrets. Hopefully we can find Giant Hearth. We've only played one, so I'm praying we top deck a Giant Hearth here. That would be great. I would love to get a Giant Hearth in play. Okay, they're down two boss now, which is good. Maybe they're in top deck mode too. That could be best case scenario. Okay, they get to two more cards. Forgot they still tower. We need to find Giant Hearth. Again, we have three in the deck. I mean, it shouldn't be that hard to find. Okay, what do we draw? That's Snover. We can bench that. Yeah, sure. So, we can't KO them this turn. There's like, no way. I do like the idea of going... We're doing 250. They'll be able to knock about Blasting Wind, which is annoying. Hmm. We need to find a cape this turn. Hit them for 250. They'll go down to 50 HP. So, we can finish off with the Volcanian. It's gonna have to be the play. Or bad here. We need to find, like, a Giant Hearth. No, we did get Welder, though. And Fire Crystal, so that works. Cape, number two? Okay, we got the last cape. That's good. A Dynamite Tackle for 250 damage. Hit them pretty hard. They got 50 HP left. So we can kill them with Heat Blast. Hmm. Maybe we should have put the Single Strike on the active so this can get Psy powered. Yeah, that might have been good. We still have Mew left in the deck. We just have the KO Tornadus and then one more Pokemon to win the game. Maybe this Hound Hour never evolves. We can KO it. They still might be in top deck mode, so we still might have that going for us. It could still be in top deck mode here. Maybe we should get Tyranitar in play for Craigalance. That could be decent. All right, do they have a supporter? Do they have a supporter in their hand? They do not. Okay. We're out of cape. We have the boss. We could save this for later. We could knock out their Tornadus here. Which doesn't... We can Eldega... Oh, no, we can't knock out Tornadus. Never mind that. Well, how much are we doing with Dynamite Tackle? 140, 160. Man, a little bit. 10 HP. They need to get two more energies on to KO me with another Tornadus VMAX. So they also have to find the VMAX. They find VMAX and two more energy to KO a Volcanian again. We're going to have to just make them have it. The Shine Hearth. We can also avoid playing the Giant Hearth in play. Yeah, we can also avoid benching, benching, putting Giant Hearth in play so they can't just body me with, uh, with the attack. So we make them find a stadium. That actually works out too. So, all right, Giant Hearth, I don't even want to use you, bro. You're dead to me. Dead to me. There's an urn. Save that. We could put the energy on the Hound Dower here. I kind of like that because we can hit for 60 and that does make a difference. If we had Hound Doom in the deck, could have won with the Hound Doom here to kill them, which would have been pretty ideal. We just put that there. And just knock him out with Heat Blast. Okay. We'll attach next turn when they hit me here. Because we might get one shot anyways. We'll see if they do get me. There's another Giant Hearth. There's Research. That's good. They could stand me to one. I do want to get another Bomb of Snow down if I can too. But I don't think they're bossing anymore. Let's see if they can kill me here. They have to get two Energies, a Tornadus, and a Stadium. They need four cards to knock me out here. I think the big thing is they have to find a stadium, and they are down three stadiums, and we didn't put one in play. There's a Marnie. That's... Eh, we might whiff the Fire Energy to attack them for Dynamite Tackle. Maybe we should put a Fire Energy on the active. Let's see what we draw. Oh, we got Boss. Oh. Okay, they found the Tornadus off of the Marnie. Did they find their last stadium off of their Marnie to five? Well, they still need another Energy, too. They'll find an Urn or a Power Energy. They still need a lot to kill me. They still need to evolve Hound Hour. They need not only a stadium and energy, they also need to evolve their Hound Hour so we don't win with boss. Because we can win with Heat Blast. Yeah, I should have put the energy on the active. I don't know why I should have put an energy on the uh, active. I just I just assumed we were doing Dynamite Tackle. This could backfire, but we have boss in hand. Okay, there's the urn. They still need a stadium. All right, Marnie, do not... Don't tell me they got Marnie into their last stadium and the urn of Vitality. As we draw an energy too, we can just knock him out. I should put a fire on the active. It's all good. If they actually have Stadium Hound... I mean, there's no way. They'd have to get super lucky to actually get everything they need to survive the turn. Yeah, they're just switching. They're going to play it safe for a turn. That's fine. Oh, they give me the Hound Hour. Did they actually get the Hound Doom off of that? Nope, they concede. All right, we got him in the end with Volcanian. I definitely could have played at the end a little bit better there. But anyway, start over the video, guys, on the Volcanian V-Deck with the Bomb of Snow. Bit of a meme. 
I'm not sure how the deck was really that good. I do think the Houndoom was not needed. I thought Houndoom was going to be a good card in the deck, but turns out we really didn't need it that much. Um, so I probably would just cut the Houndoom for a third of Bomb of Snow, and then maybe like another Pokegear or a second to Dene. That would probably be pretty good. Uh, you could add a Marsh out of the deck too to allow you to uh, get access to your stadiums a bit more in case of a Chaotic Swell. Other than that though, yeah, the deck was cool and all. Definitely cool. Just don't attack Volcanion and what are you going to do? That'll be it for you guys if you enjoyed it. Today's peach video, guys. Make sure to leave a like a video. And if you're new to the channel, subscribe. Help me on the road to reaching 18,000 subscribers, guys. Again, thank you guys for the growth on the channel recently. It has been awesome to see and appreciate the support on the content. So thanks for watching. Check out Car Archive and use Coral DF. Check out my socials. Have a good day.